Order submitted. Order filled. So I had, a, I had a dilemma here. I just wanted to see it was going to go back. Usually overruns the the mid band here on the 610 on this on the left chart. This is basically the um, the legacy strategy. It's basically coming off here as a V2 strategy, a V2 trade setup right here where we got up there. And again, that would have been a great trade for a V2. But when I'm looking at this. I'm also looking at the volume profile. I have another volume profile, another chart, and on another monitor. So this is telling me that you know we're still here at the minus. One. This may just go up here and then come back down. Just again, that's a plus two deviation. But now I'm also looking at what I'm also looking now at the fibs. The reason that's why I took this trade out. I mean, I was still gonna still write it since you can see we never. We're still getting lower lows, so this may continue going down. You see, we lower lows, lower highs. You can see here the swings, right? So we're like in between <laughs> the spot because I'm looking at my the legacy strategy here. This is basically going to set up like another V2. We have the free line still angling up, and uh, not really a lot of. Um, Confluence. I'm getting more of uh, which one call it? conflicting. So I'm going to stay with the overall trend, which is up. And also, according to the fibs, we already got a retracement retracement down to the 38.2 retracement level, which is good. Uh, not that much of a deep um, pullback. Your average pullback is around a 50% to 61.8% um, pullback. So my I lost maybe two two points or two a little over two points here here my target up here now is around five points now we're approaching close to the London market open and most likely this will continue going up so my time I have to bring this target up here at least up to there maybe around 25 that that's fine so we're looking at that that's around close to uh, eight points But I'm concerned that, again, we're getting lower highs and lower lows. So it may come back down here and come back for a deeper uh, pullback, maybe down here somewhere. Because it's due, since we already hit the extension or plus two deviation, that's usually that's where price tends to come back to the VWAP.
we're closer than we are on this area right here. No, 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 you're not going to. Right here. Or on this area. From here, or from here to here to here. That's where the area can be. And you can see where that area is. It's right at the pullback area. Right here. And maybe right here. Now we get down to the view up here, there'll be a very deep pullback. So, again, if the market, the London market opens here, we may see this coming down. Rather than going up. So like I said, I'm in, I gotta see how this market moves. Okay, I got a good signal here on my five minute chart for a good trade to the upside. So let's see if that's gonna, if that's a good signal. It, right now it looks like it's a good signal. It's on my five minute chart. So yep, okay, let's see. So that's it. That's my trade. All right, two trades. This looks like it's going way up there. It's gonna probably hit this uh, extension. So right there, 508 dollar trade on that one. I had a small 128 uh, manageable. So my net profit here is 379.